welcome back. We are back. This is Control, commenting, Tony, and behind the controls is Daniel. Oh God. This one of the PDX. Do this. We are back on the top two back on processing. I'm shaking the world. Scourge is side mission. Federal Bureau of Control, Blitzen Trench, is on the warpath, and Blitzen Tennyson reports that he wants to know who wrote it, he wants to know yesterday. Whoever it did is going to get crucified. I don't know if it was one of you guys, I don't want to know. I am not some, you know, leading a witch hunt, so tell everyone in the sector to get their heads down. Best not to be on anyone's radar right now, you know. I tell you, not even counting all the weird shit we deal with. This place can be downright hostile work environment sometimes. Signed, uh, age. Just curious on the Sorry about it. Thank <laughs> you. 
Piggy Bank. No, I remember it. It's just it's just the level. Oh, shit. Jeez, I was not expecting that. No idea if that actually matches, but go back. Okay, so the door, the chair's out. It is to the right, but it points to the left. And the painting was what? Was it a straight or normal? It was straight. The only thing was wrong with the chair. Okay, so we got the second door. Third door. Third door. Oh, the bridge probably. <laughs> Still, um, we didn't see it that long. I assume that the bridge is open.
Okay, we need to find a way to Blackrock Processing. That's where Marshall said we'd find a prism. Reminder. Reminder. If the contents of your workspace have been rearranged, removed, added to, or altered in any other way, you should immediately leave the area while speaking to yourself in a reassuring tone. This will not only keep you calm, but also the room. Thank you for your attention. If the contents of your workspace have been rearranged, removed, added to, or altered in any other way, you should immediately leave the area while speaking to yourself in a reassuring tone. This will not only keep you calm, but also the room. Thank you for your attention. Circle analysis of the atlas. The atlas is a physical expression created by the oldest house. Purpose and function are currently unknown. The specific shape and dimensions of the atlas, file in ATL-03 for said dimension, seem to indicate a more explicit purpose than the oldest house's usual walls, floors, or shifts. The atlas changes form, but we resist observation of changing its form. No visual observation has been made during its change, and it only ever occurs between frames when monitored by surveillance cameras. A previous theory was that this change corresponds to the house shifts that the atlas is our a previous theory was that the change corresponds to the house shifts and that the atlas is a redacted of the redacted control. However, the shape changes do not occur at the same time as the building shifts, which makes this theory doubtful. Structurally, the atlas is made of the same redacted material as the rest of the oldest house. Further observations will hopefully aid in discovery, discovering its purpose. Refer to file 8-37-351. Shoot, the folder closed.
Mars one and launch another person on Mars. Hey, space, up here! See, you're still you. I'm not doing so hot. You're fine. We'll push through this. The fist of the one who's doing the pushing, Doc. Take a barrel for salt. Have you noticed the recent tension between Trench and Garland? They have both been acting out recently. Trench concerns me the most. He has said that facility for a parallel project is very unlikely. He was the one who approved all the Hedron research in the first place. Dr. Garland and Dale both seek HR aid to rebuild it. I personally don't see any reason not to equip the Bureau of Staff with the additional protection of that team, especially now that there's a strong experiment on that team. What do you make of this? Have you seen anything from either of them that strikes you as odd? Let's talk in person soon before the next era of During an AWE investigation, our agents discovered a light switch cord in a Butte bungalow closet. They pulled the cord and were instantly transported to the Ocean View Motel and Casino. Dream like haze. Inside, they found a door marked with an inverted black pyramid. And just like that, it led back to the oldest house, some 2,000 miles from Montana. N now we're finding the cord in increasing numbers throughout the Bureau. Somehow the two places, they, they became in tune to each other. The, the actual physical location of the ocean view is, is, is a mystery. Stepping beyond its walls has so far proven impossible. A place of power, like the oldest house. Maybe that's a deal. Hey, thanks for bringing down that... whatever the fuck that was. But we are barely holding on here, boss. How's the situation outside, maintenance? What do I tell him? The truth is harsh, but these people seem familiar with death. The hiss are everywhere. Most of the Bureau is lost. We need Black Rock Prism to make more HRAs for any survivors in the safe rooms. I'm here to check Darling's Black Rock lab. So to recap, uh, death, disaster, and imminent destruction. Another day at the FBC. But Darling's lab is just past Black Rock Processing. But I got good news and I got bad news on that front. Good news is, it's right down the hall. Bad news is, a hiss monster has decided to move in, so that's great. Monster. That's what the rangers said. The ones that survived, anyway. But we are just treading water here, and the hiss keep coming. Salvador would know what to do, but apparently he took a security team into the containment sector just before the lockdown happened, and well, no one's seen him since. But hey, at least we got you, our fearless leader. They shouldn't rely on me. They don't know me. They don't know how I failed people. You've done a good job here, Arish, but you should take your people and get to the base and executive. You can regroup there. I'll go deal with this monster. I'm getting kind of used to them. Aye, aye, Faden. And be sure to put a bullet in that thing for me.
Arish wasn't kidding about that monster. You showed me the HRA when I first got here, and the machine that makes them. Can you help me find a prism? Utilization of paranatural elements, Black Rock. Summary Black Rock has allowed the Bureau to make great strides in containment procedures since it was first discovered. This report will examine how it is very or various structures comprised of redacted density that nullifies all resonance with a range of redacted to redacted hertz. Bureau innovations that incorporate Black Rock will be analyzed, most notably the firebreaks, feats of engineering designed to contain any future outbreaks, attacks or other internal threats. The goal of this report is to encourage Bureau staff to explore further innovations using BlackRock, as, as work in that field has mark, markedly slowed in recent years. Refer to file 5-93-1723 for full report. There are areas in the oldest house where under the right conditions, when the frequencies match, other dimensions leak in. We call these areas thresholds. The quarry is one of the more stable thresholds in the maintenance sector. That's, that's where black rock comes from, extra dimensional matter. It has the unique property of blocking out a lot of frequencies, a, a good thing. It keeps things stable, contained. Think of it as paranatural lead. Our research involves many dangerous things we absolutely need to keep in check. That's what the Black Rock Line firebreaks are about. The Panopticon container uh, cells. Sorry to interrupt, sir, but I need the code of the quarry elevator. Oh, uh, Emily. The codes. Black Rock 665. Neighbor of the Beast. Get it? Max Painter. Uh, we might go that back that far. Again, I'm pretty sure there was this a quote from Max Payne where he said that in yeah, the first game. Yeah, that's probably absolutely true. The triangle. Oh, yeah, there you got it. Bill's research on his entity, his distorted agent. Summary. If the his distorted agents are able to render themselves invisible and emit a powerful concussive blast when in close range of their target, uh, curiously, the his distorted is apparently not able to utilize both abilities at once. It must make itself visible when it goes on the offensive. The his distorted is unique in the fact that it wields a paranatural ability previously unknown to the Bureau, perhaps tapping into yet undiscovered objects of power. How does the invisibility work? How does distort the distorted become a resonance temporarily? Does it use his resonance to refract light? The physical deformations of the particular his entity is noteworthy 
in its thoroughness. Clearly, the human host would have died from such extreme alterations, which prompts the question of the government simply animated corpses to refer to file redacted for full report. We call these areas thresholds. The quarry is one of the more stable thresholds in the maintenance sector. That's, that's where Black Rock comes from. You heard that too, right? Black Rock comes from the threshold quarry. So the prisms must be there too. Think of it as paranatural lead. Our research involves many dangerous things. This should get us into the quarry. To keep in check. That's what the Black Rock line fire breaks are about. The panoptic containers. Is the one that we first talked to in the phone. Everything here is crazy. Weird, but it feels right. Like how the world should be. I am in an infinite building leading to different dimensions, and I never want to leave. Even with all the horror, I'm happy. It feels sane. Just the right kind of insane. Upgrade spin can or sorry, upgrade grip, construct spin, or construct pierce. So you want like a machine gun or a sniper rifle or you can make grip stronger. Which also unlock another upgrade slot. Okay. I think honestly the and you can still construct another weapon if you want to. The auto one is least important to me. Uh, what's this one? It's like a sniper. Um, High power, low rate of fire. And like extreme zoom? Um, I think, yeah, it's got a zoom and it's it's a rate of fire is also super, super low. Recharge, I think, is kind of slow. Low rate of, or low number of shots. So the two is going to make sense. Yeah, I'll probably s stick to the other first two. First service weapon seems pretty good. Balanced.
Dynamic energy extraction and conversion redacted sarcophagus container. The NSC was de was designed by order of Deputy Chief Trench shortly before he became director. The container provides a safe method of extraction of redacted excess energy output while acting as a main way of to house coolant pumps to keep the container and its redacted from overheating while the energy is siphoned. The energy is then conducted into converters where it is entered into redacted through the use of turbine generators. The electricity produced powers the entire powers the entire vehicle, making us completely self-sufficient and effectively invisible on the North Grid. After an SC01's disappearance by some unknown manifestation of redacted power, the occupant was restrained and a second model was built, an SC2 possesses built-in facial anchors that are designed to prevent breathing transmutative effects from its occupant. Refer to file 9-3-05 local for full report. Looks like a clutch from Quantum Leap. There's some food inside this thing. It's humane, huh? Yeah. This up. They got it covered. How expensive drink is in here? is still young. We make we must take care to avoid mistakes. Any explanation given to the public must provide the commission yet vague rationale that will reaffirm their certainty that ours is a stable controlled world. We must tread carefully, especially in this increasing technological world, with the radio and other innovations allowing information to travel at speeds previously undreamt of. This is precisely why we insist that our department handle all communications with public bodies. With all due respect, William F. Powers, head of the Department of Public Knowledge and Diversions. So he's the gas leader. Elevator's broken. Gotta get down the old fashioned way.
this correctly if you want. Okay, so that's recording? No, that's in there. It's just like I hear your voice. Additional diamond blades ASAP in this rim this time to get the clean cut research blunts. This black rock shed is tough. We're going to blaze like we're made of we're made of the damn thing. The dimensions for the slabs of black rock they want are outrageous. So all the grease they're causing me, these fire breaks better fucking work. Work a treat. Go ahead and double the last order. Expected.
Small Bureau of Personnel remind you to kind of not smoke in the quarry, even though the quarry area is technically an outdoor space. It is still a part of the Bureau, and therefore the no smoking rule does apply. Not only is this considerate toward your fellow employees to refrain from inflicting harm of secondhand smoke, it is also prudent to avoid any risk of gas fires, unforeseen threshold reactions, and possible creation of altered receptacles. Under no circumstances should cigarette butts be left in the quarry. Thank you for your understanding. Yeah. Oh, that's not what I want. button at the last second.
incident report regarding quarry operations. During my weekly safety inspection to the quarry threshold, I discovered the entire crew in a state of redacted. The whole team was redacted and aligned in very uniform direction. The city in the distance, despite my most vocal efforts to gain their attention, they remained redacted for more than redacted minutes. All I had to do was to literally redacted. Afterwards, there were days they could not provide any rationale for their behavior or any specific memories of a case being in it. My official recommendation for any crew working in the threshold area is to either shorten the length of their shifts or to carry out mandatory psychological evalu evaluations on a weekly basis, or preferably both. Maybe we should order other expeditions into the city. Refer to file 5 58 for full report. Sorry, I really remember catching that. me. The HRAs, the prisms, they need I need to get the prism to Marshall to make too late. HRAs? Then do Switch to shut the door.
I guess we'll find out what Marshall says in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Oh, well, myself, Ben, Dominic, and uh, behind the controls, Dan. Heck yeah. Thank you for being my lucky episode.